I'll be showing you how to backup slash export your Minecraft worlds from the application on any iOS device. This is a very simple tutorial, so just follow along and this should work for you. Uh, what you're going to need is the files application that comes with iOS, the Minecraft application, and Safari. So what you want to do first is go into Safari and then go to this website. So once you go to this website, it'll be in the description below so you can easily just click on it. You're going to be brought to this screen. Hold on the download from Minecraft and then you want to click on download linked file. And then go to your downloads tab and then all you're going to want to do is it's so it's right here all you're going to want to do is go into your files application and then go to wherever that downloaded so in my case it downloaded on my uh, ipad sometimes it might go to icloud drive depending on your setup so you want to just hold on this and then click on copy or move so i'm just going to move this and what you're going to want to do is move this to your Minecraft folder. So on my iPad, you want to look for Minecraft, games, com.mojang, and then scroll down until you see resource packs. Not development resource packs, but just regular resource packs. Tap on it, click move, and that will move it to that location. So you want to go to your resource packs where you move that. You can just tap on this and it will open inside Minecraft. And then it will start saying importing. So import started. And then successfully imported mobile export. Sometimes even if it says it failed, all you're going to want to do is still try and follow these steps that I'm about to show you. Um, if you don't see any of the uh, tabs or settings that I start clicking, then that means it did fail. But at times I have seen that this has failed, but it still shows up in the Minecraft for some reason. So I don't know why it says it failed. But in my case right now, it says that it was successfully imported. Um, so if it did fail for you and you're not seeing any of these tabs, just redo this process. So click on settings then, scroll down until you see global resources, and then s select my packs. You will see the mobile export tool, click on it, and then click activate. And now under active, you should see your mobile export tool. And then click on play. Here are my worlds, and I'm just going to export the survival world. So I would just click on the edit icon, scroll down until you see export world, and this will show up. This will be in a form of a .mc world file. So you're going to want to click on save to files and then save it wherever you want to save it. So I'm just going to save it outside the Minecraft folder on my iPad. Click save and then it should say world export finished successfully. Now. This is the backup stage, so you've just backed up your Minecraft. Um, inside the resource packs folder, you will see this. I would just leave everything the same. Don't delete anything. Um, but once I go out on my iPad, here is my survivalworld.mc world. So when you transfer this to another device, you're gonna wanna just click on this or hold it, and then you're gonna want to click move or copy. And then you want to copy it into your Minecraft games, com.mojang, Minecraft worlds folder. Copy that over and then you're just going to want to tap on it from in here. Um, other than that, that is it for this tutorials. I just showed you how to back it up and uh, how to transfer it into your Minecraft worlds for another uh, device. If this worked for you, great. If it did not, let me know in the comment section below. Everything you will need is in the description box below. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time.